don't know me, Aerospace Specialty Products. Uh, I've been around for a little over 20 years. Uh, been away from there for a few years. It's good to be back, see a lot of uh, old faces. Some didn't recognize mine because the beard is gone. Uh, but if you excuse me, I'm woefully unprepared, so I'm going to go ahead and ramble on a little bit. Um, Aerospace Specialty Products, and a lot of people just know it as ASP, ASP produce uh, scale kits, competition kits, carry competition supplies, and some sport kits with an emphasis on um, bulk kits for beginners in schools. Uh, some of our ever popular, particularly competition supplies, are the quarter mill mylar chutes, which comes in kits for uh, regular chutes, the over easy chutes, which are a little bit heavier primarily for egg lofters, and you can also get the raw canopies if you want that. And this is the raw material that you can get in 54 inch square, which I don't have with me today because my new tube, my new roll came the day after I left. The ever popular Mylar tape, which has 173 uses, or at least three, so don't last me that uh, It's a big roll, it lasts you a long time. A lot of people use it. Uh, it's been very popular over the years. Uh, the comp shoots and stuff were gone for a while because of the uh, scarcity of the material. It's back now, I've had it back for several years. Uh, again, very popular for duration flyers. Also, tracing paper and uh, Dural R streamers. These should be really popular this week. This is a, uh, a two mil thick silver mirrored material. It takes a really great crease. I've got them in anywhere from three inches up to eight inches. I do have a few of the eight inch left if you need something for this week. So get with me on the field tomorrow. past couple of years, we have done a lot with, I've had the website totally redone, a total revamp on that. I'm very pleased the way it came out. If you haven't checked it out lately, please do. Uh, also took a good amount of the past two years or so and redid a lot of the older scale kits, rewrote the instruction sheets, those that had not had uh, laser cut fins now have laser cut fins hooks on them, some of them didn't have hooks. So a little upgrade to pretty much all the older kits. There's still a handful that need some work, but I'm real pleased again with the way that came out. Uh, another kind of evergreen popular product is the Epoxo 88 that I carry and I've had it for several years. I really believe in this product. It is a two-part paste epoxy that will set up in six minutes, but unlike other quick setting epoxies, it sets very hard. You can also take it and drill it, dremel it, sand it down. I have these in a the regular, which is a whitish. Also, they call it clear, which is translucent. Um, really good product. If you haven't tried it, I really encourage you to give it a try. I don't know anybody that's tried it that hasn't liked it. And several well-known rocketeers buy it from me pretty regularly. Also, auto body shops and some aviation people that buy it. Uh, it comes in a 18-ounce set and a seven ounce set. I am getting low on the seven ounce set, but I do have a really nice price because I'm heavily socked on the 18 ounce sets of both the regular and the clear. And I've also got a good combo price if you want to get one of the regular and the clear uh, at the field. I do have, if you need them, I do have Jolly Logic products here this weekend. Uh, the shoot release and a few altimeters and some other things. We'll have those on the field. We will be here only through tomorrow, be leaving Monday morning, unfortunately. So check us out on Vendor Row if you need anything then. Uh, new this year, I've come out with some new scale kits and 1.9 inch tube, 29 millimeter motor mounts. Um, a few old favorites, Sandia Sandhawk, the Region Tomahawk, and of course, Another whack corporal because I do need another whack corporal to get in the line. I don't have enough as it is. Um, the idea behind these kits are they're not coming out as ultra detailed 
They do have accurate scale outlines. If you want to just have a nice rocket, scale rocket to go out and fly on the weekends, an easy build, where you don't have to feel compelled to do a lot of detailing. <coughs> Come with self-adhesive decals. Um, again, good sturdy tube. Nice flyer on 29 millimeters. They fly great on like the Estes F-15s, nice slow flights, very realistic looking on those. Uh, then you can also up, if you want to upscale them, you need something for giant support scale, add your rivets out that you know what, go right ahead. You can add as much detail to as you want on these. Do have a few more of these in the pipeline. I'm not going to say what or promise dates on them because I've bit myself in the rear by doing that before. Uh, but end of the year, first of next year, look for some more in this line and a couple other scale kits that I'm also working on in, uh, in like a D12 size, uh, 20 millimeter. And that's the quick and dirty. Questions? All right, thanks. Good to see you. Thank you.